availability of very novel agents means that the inflammation now can be completely switched off in a high proportion of patients. In addition to that, we now know for the first time just recently that if you can switch off inflammation for long enough, the body actually recovers. It recovers its normal immune status and it is even possible to get patients so well they can stop therapy. We now have patients who have no symptoms whatsoever of their disease and are now on no therapy. They are a minority, but the ambition will be to treat more and more patients at the right time with the right therapies. Today, what percentage of patients can, can be on remission? With conventional therapies, it's about one in five. Uh, with best therapies, even started slightly later, it's about one in three, one in two. Uh, but they're not, those therapies are not always available outside clinical trials. But I think governments are going to realize it's cost effective to use these agents early and for shorter periods of time.